Hello everybody, this is Tofe Online Class 2. So after we have installed the tools properly, now we can enter the software. I have connected my hard drive to the SATA 0, so I click the SATA 0 channel to select the software I want to open. For example, I want to open the DDP module. Okay, I have entered the software. The very basic thing we need to do is to set up the working directory. Click Setup Options. Here, we can set up the working directory. Usually, we can change this one because the C drive is the system drive and it, it is growing. And we can change it to one drive with bigger size. For example, uh, I can change to my D drive. Or E drive. Click OK. And then click. And here, one more thing uh, we just want to mention is about the soft reset, hard reset, power reset. For this one, it controls the universal settings for the nature tasks. We may use with the disk image or file extraction. We can untick these three, untick them and click OK. Because for some hard drives, if we tick this reset, once it get ready status and it reset and it lose the ready status, the drive comes busy again. So you may not use the reset setting for such kind of special cases. For example, for hard drives for Hitachi or Toshiba, or some uh, uh, CG hard drives, if you want to rebuild the translator virtually, then you may not use these reset settings. Just untick them. So before you use the tool, the working directory and also the soft hard reset, power reset settings need you to configure them. So this is a very basic setting. And also, users need to check under the menu about DFL. And users can find out the current software version which is being used. And the users compare, can compare this version with the latest version users find within our forum to see if the current version is the latest one. If not the latest one, users need to enter the forum and download the latest software version to install to replace the current old versions. Okay, these are the very basic settings users need to check and find out about setup options, the working directory, and the reset settings. Thank you for watching this basic video.